Hello everyone and welcome back to Steralis. It's been a while since I've covered this game and I've decided to come back and just go into it into a standard mode because unfortunately New Horizons isn't compatible with the latest version and I wanted to see what's going on in 2.6.4 especially with the Federation's mod and then I decided, or not mod, but a DLC and the Lithoid race pack because I haven't ever showcased them so I want to make myself a Lithoid race called the Everright Multitude. So as you can see we are going hive mind. I feel like a species of elementals would be hive mind. That's just my personal opinion. So what I went with is subspace synapse. It's good that means we're gonna have a little bit more naval capacity not a terrible amount aesthetic. We have habitability and <clears throat> Sorry, have ability increase and pop amenity usage decrease. We obviously have the consciousness, which will war gain or war exhaustion gain minus 20% and extra monthly influence. We are lithoids, so we consume minerals instead of food, so we won't need minerals at all, which is kind of nice. We're hive minded, so we're not affected by happiness. I went intelligent because as a hive mind, I feel like with all the individual minds in the. I have no idea that you kind of the the hive mind itself you know there should be some boosts but I feel like since that we're gonna unruly isn't the title I was going for since we're hive minded I feel like the more pops we have the more sprawl we're gonna have just because of the vast of space so it kind of made sense and then we have industrious so we can mine extra minerals because they're gonna be key for us and obviously we are going to be using a lithoid ship on a relic world I believe that's how I have these guys set up. Let's actually take a peek here on the origin. Yep, on a relic world. So we're kind of like the byproduct. I believe we're a very old and ancient race is kind of what I went with. And why am I messing with that? Alright, so we're going to go to 800 stars. Give us lots of that. I really don't want to deal with fallen empires too much. I'm going to turn the late game on later. Get that off. No victory year, so we can play through a lot. Uh, let's see, we'll go to... Yeah, we'll play Commodore, since it's been a while. And I don't want to have to be micromanaging, pausing, and focusing on the game. I want to talk more than micromanage. Because if I have to micromanage on Admiral, or Grand Admiral, yeah, it'll be more interesting. So basically, the origin here is the standard permanent origin. So once our empire spanned the void, once your fleet controlled much of the galaxy and then came to defeat the, the fall. Finally, after the millennia of purgatory, it is time to return to the stars. At long last, our civilization has rebuilt to the point of interstellar travel. The galaxy should be ours again. So, several legions of our prime, every prime, are still in ruins. So we need to clear those areas now to... They basically give us bonus resources. So if we go to our home world, under here, so there's ruined archaeology. Lots of those, or we got to go in there. And these, basically, once we start clearing those out, upon clearing, we get a population for each of these, which is nice. Collapse burrows, that's a population, generator district, gen mining district. So, it doesn't look like there's anything crazy on our planet, which is fine. It's producing decent enough resources. We do not need consumer goods or food. Food is because we eat minerals, and consumer goods is because we're high of mind. We don't have to worry about any of that. Tech drone. Who's producing what? Okay, so our mining drones are producing that. Maintenance drones are producing amenities. Okay. So first and foremost, we don't really have enough money for anything. For minerals. Go to the minerals. Um, we can't afford to buy any. That's fine. Alright, so let's go and immediately get better research speed. That's a, probably the best way to go. Increase unity, of course. Um, are minerals some jobs? Yes, that's going to be very important. Let's take a look here at our starting sections. So, it looks to me that this is a choke point over here. Because there's no way out there. Our other choke point will be down here. And I will see if we can push out to here. Maybe here, because that would be a better choke point, because that would lock up that whole section. And I'd like to lock this up 
as soon as possible. So immediately what we're going to do is go to our shipyard, queue up another science vessel. So we're going to need two of those. Actually, I need to move this a little bit. I don't know where to put this. Uh, that'll work. Yeah, that's in a good spot now. It's not blocking anymore. Alright. Science vessel. Start surveying your way here. Our construction ship. First priority is the research nodes. Those are going to pay dividends early on. So we get our tech rolling. Alright. Edicts, what do we got? Map the stars. I don't want to burn all my influence on map the stars because we need that desperately early on. I'll go on fast to speed for a little bit. Pause. We got another science vessel built. Let's take a look at what we have for leaders. Oh uh, boy. None of you are going to be very good for what I want to do. Unfortunately, I'm going to sell a bunch of minerals, even though I need them desperately. Because I need to recruit a new leader. I swear to God. Okay, good. Not the best for exploration, but it's all we have at the moment, which is kind of crappy. Then I'd like to immediately get ourselves in position. So you go that way, come down this way, so we can get that locked up at least. Strategic resource. Nice. Doesn't really help too much. I'd like to build that up. Get the mines going. Good job. Um, discovery or expansion? Expansion's probably going to be better. Okay, you build that. Then you can get that starbase underway next. I have to be a little picky. Get that construction ship going. Leave that be for now. Okay, why did we lose power like crazy all of a sudden? Okay, keep it like that. We need our power districts running, guys. Come on. No, we're not. Relax, robot friend. Start moving there, at least. And then, do we have enough? that be for now. That we're fine there. Get 
that outpost building. Our science ships was just to made a... Yep, we have a bunch of planets nearby. That's good. But we gotta get our choke points built first. Oh, crap. Um... Get a bunch of power from these zones. Do that. How much do our colony ships cost? Oh, those are expensive. We'll hold off on colonizing until we get a little bit further into our game plan here. Hmm. Yeah, probably get more unity production next. Construction complete. No, don't need defense armies, but we do need synaptic posts. Wait a minute, if we push and take that, we lock this entire section. Construction complete. Anomaly found. Leave that be for now. Okay, I can work with that. Oh, damn. Mine station output for mineral miners. Um, overall station gains would be great. I want to take that choke point. Then you can cut around this way. Search speed. Yep, survey speed. System geology shot. System survey complete. Innovation rollout. Top growth, yes, please. Come on, we're almost where we can lock it down. Build the power. Build one mine, please. Alright, alright. Okay, we're doing 
doing good here. Got your second our power issues taken care of. Leave it be for now, and then after you're done that, go this way. Start surveying the rest of our little locked off empire. A 10 power? Oh, dang, 4, 4, 2. That's going to be so good. Yep, keep building. Um, and then shipyards. Get a colony going. We got to start colonizing. We need to get pops rolling. We need to get things moving. Oh, freaking good time here. Alright, I want to slow down for a second. Get my bearings, see if we... Found. It would be for now. I go into my leader pool. Recruit a scientist. Get rid of you. Agree. Didn't get anyone good yet. It's fine. Oh, there's engineering there. Okay, well, with that then, once you're done, survey that, then come back here and survey these. Because that's going to be locked off. I'd rather take it than not take it. Here. Alright, we're doing okay resource wise. Nothing terribly good or bad about that. Our pops are producing nicely. Alright, so overall we're having a good boost. Pop growth speed 10%, yes. I want to take this one first, 100% honest. This would be 10 power. It solves a lot of our energy output needs and allows us to take a bunch of stuff. Boost the game speed again. Because this is already a choked off. System survey complete. System geology That's more important. As soon as we have the influence, we'll take that one. Just once those two points are taken, no one's getting into our, our empire. Build those mining stations. Immediately. Leave it be for now. Technology. How are we doing? Doing pretty good. Oh, we're missing some housing. Alright. One more month, one more month. You can move here then. Oh yeah, colonize that world. And immediately, oh, next month we should have a mineral soon. Oh, that's a big boost. Oh, um, this would be better for our star bases. Might be a silly thing to do, but you know, we need to have our ability to lock in things. Definitely need tech to reduce housing costs. We have. Uh, leave it be for now. Alright. System geology charted. Research speed. At least we're in a good position. I mean, we're locking in a section of the galaxy just for us. System geology charted. Actually, immediately. Oh, we can't do that yet. That's fine. Construction complete. 
That's a 15. That's a 15. I'd rather take that one. Actually, no. Nope. You just move here. Build that. Um, policies. Initial contact status. I don't want our borders open to anyone. Leave it be. Wait, where is this? Leave that be. Excellent, excellent. Top growth, nice. Don't need tile blocking. Clearing technology yet. Pretty far away from using that, effectively. Oh, 200. Alright, I want to immediately upgrade you then. Why? Because I want our defenses built. <laughs> Perfect. Station output 10% from researchers or physics. I'd rather get a boost the physics, to be honest. Alright, so we have a, two more worlds that we can take. At least that we found in here. There might be more. And all that matters is taking up some areas to secure them. Leave that be for now. Do that one. You're moving. Okay, housing's not a problem now. Allies are not a problem. I'd like some more, but I'd rather jump into more research. Because that's going to be key for us. Okay, leaders. Don't need that. Already have one like that. Anomaly discovery. I'd rather have more anomalies be discovered. Investigate that. Alright, then come back this way. Start researching anomalies. Need a mine on both. Alright, so that improves output mining. Oh, we're not going to see strong production. Now, you surveying because you have the best chance of finding anomalies, please. Yeah, we'll get you to a dig site eventually, my friend. Oh, I didn't hit on pause. Oops. <laughs> you move here after you built up that mining station. Need that really. Ability doesn't matter. Ooh. I feel 
feel like being more efficient with prosperity is going to be more important. I need a generator district. Situation log updated. Mm, we'll wait till we have a little bit more research points. How much is colonization? Oh, nothing. Station output. Yep, that's more important than anything else right now. So four stations, four power. That's not terrible. Um, immediately build that. Build that. Build that. Go back here and build that, please. System geology charted. Doing good, we're doing good. Rocket new tech. Nice. Um, let's get this going. Move shielding. Our shipyard should be able to. Oh, we don't have. Now we have it. Oh, there's another world. Good. Good. One, two. Three plants left. Let's come back this way. And then what do I want to survey after that? System survey. Power, our prosperity. Uh, upkeep on districts, please. That is huge overall when you think about how much you build over time. Keep doing that. Fascinating. Level 15 world. As an anomaly, can't get it. Fifteen again. Go and colonize it. Uh, Empire sprawls fine. We'd be good for now. Still have a bunch to check out. System geology Construction complete. And another planet, nice. Anomaly found. Research complete. 
establishing Lithosphere. Accretion complete. Alright, next allies are going into that star base. Our northern one is built and defended. So we have our empire secured, which is nice. Alright, making really good progress here. Alright, we need to save those for now though. Could we buy enough? Yeah, that'll boost us getting us a lot. They're a lot faster. Eventually that planet will be self-sufficient. Just be a bit. Innovation rollout. Investigate that. Tech. Energy credits. Yes. As much as I'd like the one of these, I think that's quicker, faster, and overall gonna give us the most benefit. So you get more power generation. Another colony ship, just in time. Would like to build another network area. Drones are building and growing. I think after this colony, we're going to hold off on colonizing just for a bit until we can get everything else figured out. That's really good. Build cost and build speed. Communications established with potential. We have made first contact with an alien empire. They appear to have mastered space flight just as we have. I recommend a healthy. Wait, there's another. Until we learn their intentions. System survey complete. Accretion complete. Pulling away from enemy fleet. If I can secure another big chunk, but I need to make sure. Situation log updated. That increases that. That'd be nice to have, but let's start getting a little bit more cautious about not researching any military tech. That's gonna be important now. Alright. We're good there. Um, do we get more ally production? Spawning pools? Definitely a necessity on every world with that pop growth. We have a lot of resources to take, and a lot of sections to take. But we've secured our two main borders, which is amazing. Leave that be our anomaly guy. We'll get it. Okay, society boost. We'll probably get some food production eventually, just because then we can build the organic the bio generators. Spawning pools, please. We're starting to be a little bit more efficient on our colonies. I don't think we're going to dive too much more on that. Oh, got another one done. Nice. Get that good. I love the rock and new tech thing. That's awesome. Research station output, yes. Security 
Build the research station and the mine stations. Alright, so yeah, our worlds are probably going to have to produce a little bit more power. But again, research labs are important to me. Okay, so if we can get here quickly. At least to there, I can get another choke point. Move it. You have a very key mission now. Just survey that quickly. And come back this way. Great, that's going to cost us a lot of research points. It's fine. It's fine. Alright. Get more housing, please. Okay, pause. How are we doing in comparison? Our economy is better. <laughs> Sandar Envoy. They don't like them. Situation log updated. Might as well get those going. They're growing fast, which is good. Colony ship is almost ready. Start building that starbase. Okay, yeah, so if we hit that, we've locked them out. Better energy grids? Yes, please. Build research. Build mining. How many points do you have? Not a lot. Okay. Do me a favor. Build that. Build that. And move here. Nice. Colony ship. Colonize, yes. Power districts, get them going. Situation log. Build that mining base. Build that star base. Build it, build it, build it, build it, build it, build it. Quick, 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 quick. Come on, come on. We need it. Oh, nice. Oh, 
Why don't you go and build those bases up? Because those would be good. You build those mining bases, and then this immediately. Starbase. Done. We have our own little chunk of the galaxy. Not massive, but enough. Blocked him off. Hopefully he gets cut off by someone, otherwise he'll get a lot of power. Quickly. Beautiful. And then you can start surveying this way. Situation log updated. I'll have to do that in a bit. Additional housing. Construction complete. Hainer Bay, on battery. Switch that out for Hainer Bay. That's going to take a while, so no. We can at least get that going to get better reactor tech started. Oh, and we found an... Perfect. Homeworld shipyards. I'd rather have two buildings to build ships on. So I have two more worlds at minimum to get. I got those. So that's a lot of planets. We'll be good planet wise. And we have six, seven, eight in our little area, plus a ton of resources. Um, should I rather do that? There's a spawning pulse. System survey complete. Get that, get that. Get that started. Alright, sorry. We're good. Oh, we have another world. Good. Oh, boy. Um, what up? Where's our sprawl? Oh, our sprawl just grows over time. Innovation rollout. Complete. 
Okay. Um... Better warships would be nice. Alright, ship designer. and sublight speed. Oh my god. Lost track of stuff for a second there. Okay. Oh boy. Oh boy. Wars are starting. I don't like this. <laughs> yeah, we'll let them in our territory. I feel like this confederate. Okay, we need more ally production. There's no question on what stuff's going to be now. Our fleets need to build up. Just upgrade our defensive line there? Yes, please. Go take that for me.
Oh boy. Oh boy. Gun battery hanger bay. Special project complete. Okay, what's that? Any anomalies? Okay, no. And I need you to start surveying in the northern sector. And tell me what's here. Don't be harming relations with us. I'm trying to be your friendly space rocks. Metal coil guns. Oh, we have destroyers. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I need an alliance with someone here. They're not really going to be able to break our borders, I think. I say hope not. Special project complete. Need all those minerals battling it out. Okay. 
Okay. Looking all right. We should be able to get that in there to our favor soon. Nope, not entering that. Build the first corn. Build another Corvette. Gonna set the ten Corvettes. Okay, we need mining districts. <sighs> Better shield tech is always good. Physics research. Alright. All the mining stations. We have found an anomaly. We're good, we're good, we're good. System geology shot. Oh, their economy collapsed. Oh wow, you won your war. What did we get? Oh yeah, keeping us alive. Districts up and running ASAP. System geology charted. Yeah, we need the good tech to pop up for us here. You to go over here and build that next. System survey complete. Start to Actually, I don't think System I want to go. Complete. Okay. Oh, we need to get tire blocker tech going.
Oh, that's strictly for the influence, or not the influence, it's on the engineering attack would be great. Another tech lab. Yes. Attrition complete. We need some military pops here. How are we doing here? Do we have order friction? We do. It's a bit. I don't know how they won that war. I don't know what to build here. Probably tech. Yeah, 10%. I'd be a fool not to take that 10%. Alright, I feel like we are in a decent position now. Don't feel like we're about to get annihilated. Once you're done with your buildings there. I'd like to push up to there. Probably move you this way. Research complete. What do we finish? Physics. Energy credits or disruptors? Energy's fine. Better weaponry would be better. Wait a minute. Finish those missions. Shipyards. Build me toward. Make Corvettes a little bit better. Oh, you're a fallen society. Okay. Which means we can take that. I'll build a garrison there, and they're not going anywhere else. Beautiful. Take it apart. Alright. Build up all the hive worms. Can we clear anything on this yet? Might as well start clearing that out. System survey complete. System survey complete. Yes, purification plants. <laughs> 
sorry, but until I feel like our fleet can handle itself. They're still really freaking strong. Why don't they like us? Holy crap, the galaxy got... Hold on. I didn't even realize that we had this entire area. Oh my god. Okay, we're getting our butt kicked in many different ways right now. It's basically fleets. Our tech is trying to keep up. I'm trying to keep our tech going. But the AI cheats just so much, I can't keep up. Alright, so where are we at? So we have a decent fleet. We have the resources to build another colony ship. Let's get that queued right away for next time. Minerals. Got a stupid stockpile. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Big stockpile of minerals. Build that up. Because you know what? We should build two colony ships, because we can then go and colonize those two worlds, or those two. I'm probably going to colonize these two worlds first. Yeah. I mean, I haven't colonized any relic world would be nice. It has an archaeologist site on it, and it's going to unleash the space dragon if I excavate that. And I really don't have the fleet to take on the space dragon right now. Or some crazy monster thing. But I think I will send our fleet to clean up that. And that. But not till I have a science ship available. Because I need a science vessel to clean up the debris and get any tech out of it. But we are looking fairly secure now. I do think we need to get better point defense research once that comes up. Because as soon as we start getting overwhelmed by fighters and missiles, things will get ugly. I hope you guys enjoyed episode 1 of the Everite Multitude. The Lithoid species pack is being used here, along with Federations, Megacorp. Basically, all the DLC is active in this playthrough, so you should see a little bit of everything. I probably will eventually go and try to get Federation tech so I can make some allies. But for now, I kind of want to play as an isolationist and just, you know, claim our territory, build up and then start picking them off one by one, depending on who becomes the bigger threat first, or who threatens us, or attacks us, because I feel like we're going to get attacked before we attack someone. So with that being said, I hope you enjoyed. See you next time. Ciao for now.